Hey, how's it going? So today is Friends Day, uh, which is the, the day that um, it's Facebook's 12th birthday. And you know every year, people always talk about us as a company. So we all kind of thought that this would be a good day to instead celebrate how people around the world are connecting using the, the internet and Facebook and um, all the different tools. And um, you know, so Friends Day is a day to celebrate your friends, right, and the people who make your life meaningful. And um, so I thought that it would be a good idea on Friends Day to uh, pull these guys out of whatever <laughs> meetings they were in um, before, um, because these are some of the most special people in my life who uh, have been my friends and who I've worked with for more than 10 years, um, and have been, that they're all on the management team here at, at Facebook and are responsible for um, so many of the things that you guys use uh, every day. So I figured it would be pretty fun to, uh, to embarrass them and, um, and, and to just, and to go through and, um, and, and, and tell some funny stories about uh, how, we, how we got started working together and um, also some of just our favorite moments and stories that we've heard from uh, people in our community using, using these products. And you know, each of us have a, a slightly different uh, view of, of the community because of the different products that we build. Naomi is focused on. Um, <laughs> and I was going to start with KX because we, we've known each other for, for, um, for the longest. Um, but um, you know, Naomi focuses on growth and connecting everyone uh, in the world to to each other and, and to our services. Um, KX is is currently working on newsfeed and has worked on a whole lot of things out of the company. Um, Boz runs ads now and likewise is also built a, and run a whole lot of things at the company over the last 10 years. Yeah, we just changed spots. Yeah, exactly. you just run ads. Right? <laughs> 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 you have to change it up. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, and Chris um, runs probably most of the products, actually, um, is the chief product officer, newsfeed, and most of the stuff that you think about is Facebook on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, this guy is running at this point. And, um, so, all right, so, so let's, let's get started. So KX, I've, I've known the longest. Um, and we first met at, on, I think it was the first day of our first computer science class. At 121. At Harvard, 121, yeah. um, theoretical computer science. And I... Um, Entry level. D, D, <laughs> D, 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 D Harry Lewis. Um, it was. It was. Harry Lewis. Lewis. Harry Lewis. Was Shout out to Harry Lewis. Yeah. 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 Um, Were you the TA? No, 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 we'll get to that. We'll get to that in a second. Um, plenty of that. Um, and, you know, one of the things that I remember at KF, so, I'd, so I showed up to class that day, and I was wearing my shirt inside out and backwards. <laughs> so my tag was literally sticking out the back. And um, I guess, like, I don't know, I'd just been up all night the night before coding and working on a bunch of different stuff. And um, so, I, so I showed up to class, and I just looked like a mess. And, like, no one would talk to me. And, and I was like, why? I'm like, do I like look weird? Am I like doing something weird? And KX just had no problem with it. Aww. And, and, and that's where I noticed. Yeah. <laughs> that's just as good. Yeah. Um, so we started working together on all our problem sets. And, um, and we took probably, I mean, I, I didn't make it through college, but um, you, you did. Um, and you joined after you graduated. But we probably took like four or five classes yeah. together across um, computer science, math. Um, psychology, just a lot of the different disciplines that um, that touch a lot of the work that, that we're doing here now. And, um, and KX probably more than anyone else is responsible for getting me through college, because while I was working on... Oh, well, you didn't um, get through college. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> so you, so you, 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 you had one job. Uh, <laughs> um, for getting me through the two years that I got through, um, because we did our problem sets together and um, and Kax was always smarter and, and was able to, you know, there would be like six problems and Kax would do five of them and I'd do one and we'd say we collaborated. And, um, you know... Which was actually allowed at Harvard. It's worth pointing out. Yeah, it's worth pointing out that was actually how problems that were supposed to be done. Baz was ITA, he would know. Right? Yeah, that's right. But, um, but one of the things that I actually remember the most from my time in school was we'd go out and get pizza like almost every night, right? We'd go to Pinocchio's, yeah, yeah. right? And, um, and, it was close enough to Harvard Square, right? It was in Harvard Square, and um, and we just talk about the future and how we thought technology was going to change things and how people connecting was going to change things, and um, it was funny because I think we just took for granted that over time, people would want to connect online, and you know, for us and the the different friends that we had and the people that 
that we talked to and worked with in college, that was a pretty common belief, right? That the internet was going to be this great tool for people to come connect and make new friends and stay in touch with the people who they love. Um, but it, it turned out outside of that little group to not be something that a lot of people around the world were focused on. And that's why I think so many people from that time have kind of come together and, um, and, and worked on, on this company to, to bring a lot of those tools to the world. So, um, so thank you for being a friend and getting me through two years of college <laughs> um, and, for, and for, um, for everything you've done here so far in building up Facebook and helping connect everyone. So what's, so what's been your, um, what's your favorite story that you've heard from someone who's used the different things that you've built? Uh, yeah. Since you've been here, there's um there's a really personal one. So a lot of us uh, recently had kids. Actually, four of us sitting on this couch right now. Um, and I think it's one thing that's been cool over the years is kind of growing up with this group uh, uh, of people as coworkers, but as friends, and you know, going through this experience together as well. And uh, not just with your direct friends, but also the power of Facebook and Facebook groups and getting to connect with other people who are going through the same thing. And uh, one one thing that's actually been really personal recently has been there's this amazing group called the Physician Moms Group uh, on Facebook that my wife is a part of. She's a doctor uh, at Stanford, and uh, this group is I think over forty thousand uh, physicians who are mothers, uh, all kind of going through the same thing, and it's, it's just one of the most amazing things. Yeah, Priscilla joined that group too. Oh, awesome. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's something crazy, like one in four new mothers who are physicians. Yeah. Something. Is that true? I, I think, like, given how many doctors there are in the United States and how many of those who are mothers, it's a surprisingly high, high um, version. I've heard about it from a lot of new mothers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just like, oh, yeah, I know that group. I know that group. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. What's up? All right. <laughs> so, like, so, like, being, being What's alive, your master being plan? alive, there is no master plan. <laughs> I um I literally sent these guys a message like 20 minutes before we're gonna do this. I'm like I don't know what cancel your meeting. What work you thought you were in? We're going we, live. We tried to get Cheryl to come join, but apparently she's doing work. Um, so yeah. that um so we'll see we'll see if she can stop by. But uh, apparently she's less interruptible than than the rest of us here, uh, who can just hang out on Facebook all day like um like you. Um, so all right. So being uh, alive and, and being interactive. Um, we, we want to make sure that we're getting questions from people. Hey, we got Cheryl! Yeah. 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 We were. We were. We were, we were, we were talking about how you're actually doing the work. And, and you're all just hanging out. Just hang out here. Come closer. Were you telling her so, I was trying to get you to pose in front of the camera? The balloons and walk you with? Um, no, I didn't tell that story. <laughs> but, um, but I mean, but you can. You'll, you'll have that. You know, we'll have that opportunity. What stories are we telling? Um, so we're, we're going to audience participation. Okay. Right? Because yeah. being, being alive, you know, part of the magic of this is that is that we can direct, right? So it's not just we're making a video; it's people can ask questions. So, if you guys have questions yeah. for yeah. any of us, um, just jump in, and we'll intersperse that with our own stories as well. And then we're going to Boz next. Yes. Do you want to okay, more Jonathan, questions. Jonathan yeah. says, "Happy Friends Day," and what's coming next for Facebook? <laughs> Broad question. Yeah, um, <laughs> a lot of room to run on that one, Mark. <laughs> yeah. uh, Make it tight. Happy Friends Day to to you too. Jonathan. Uh, Jonathan, thank you for, for, for the question. One of the big things that we're really focused on, you know, the mission is to connect everyone in the world, right? And now we've been lucky enough over the last uh, 12 years to go from the service that helps college students stay connected to now, um, you know, more than one and a half billion people around the world use these services to stay connected to the people that they care about and, um, and, and share ideas and, and uh, shape the world in, in, in the way that they want. And, you know, I think it's easy to think about it, a community that, that's that large as, um, as if, you know, the, this is such a, a, an accomplishment or something that we've done, but we look at it as you know, there's seven billion people in the world. So there's, uh, you know, five and a half billion people who we're not doing what we need to yet. Uh, and that to me is the, is the biggest part of our mission and what we need to go do. And, um, and when we think about that, you know, a lot of people around the world don't have the opportunities of even being on the internet, right? About four billion people um, aren't connected, and there are all these things that um, that we have to do, and that Naomi will probably talk about in a bit to just make sure that everyone has this kind of equal opportunity of access to not just Facebook and, and tools for sharing, but education tools, um, tools to get health information, um, you know, just all the different kinds of stuff that's important. So 
Um, that's something that we'll talk a lot about, and, um, and I'm happy to go on for a long time about that. <laughs> happy Friends Day, Jonathan. Yeah. All right, let's go to Boz. Yeah. So Boz I met shortly after KX, uh, when, when I was in school. And I met him because he was the teaching fellow in my first AI class. I would pay so much money. I know, me too. Let's reenact it. Let's reenact it. Mark, so, you, you, one scene of Mark not showing up to section. <laughs> yeah. Mark didn't yeah. always show up to section. No, he was busy building Mark, building Never the face. Never showed up to section. I busy building the face. I've yeah. read Mark's kindergarten report card. Is that right? Yes, I have. I, I don't think you can share Mark's you know what it said? Yeah. <laughs> you know what it said? I, I did well in 182, you and your class. <laughs> and in kindergarten. It said that he liked to build things, and he did not like to be told what to do. Oh, oh my well. God. <laughs> and nothing um, has changed. So, all right, well, look. Consistency, apparently, is a, is a virtue. So, Boz, I mean, one of the impressive things about, about you is that I, I think you know, you've always been a really good leader, but you've, you've evolved and changed so much. I mean, you, when, I, when I first met you, um, you everyone hold your faces. <laughs> Please keep it together. Um, I'm trying to talk. All right. Thank you. Um, you know, one of the projects that we had in, in um, our AI class was this. Was it a fellow? Mm -hmm. the, yeah. the game that we had to play. That's right. And Boz made it very clear at the beginning of the class that no one would ever beat his a fellow player. <laughs> and. No, it's, it's that kind of... Was it true? Um, I think it is. Nobody in the class beat it. Although, it was. Chang Ma is a, a student we were talking about recently, actually, who did tie my fellow player. <laughs> well, so he was right. Uh, so the, the, the boldness uh, was, was justified in, in, in this case. But, you know, I think part of it is, um, you know, over time, when, when I actually started uh, trying to build the team, right, the first couple of years at Facebook, we were just this very small crew, and then when we actually started trying to get people together, I basically uh, just reached out to all the people who were my teachers at Harvard, who I worked with, who, um, who were the smartest people who I had um, who I'd met, which is how, how these two guys joined. And um, and Boz was definitely at the, the top of the list of the people who, who were my teachers um, because, you know, w w I mean, in, in the AI class, I mean, just the, the clarity that you brought and how inspiring you were as a teacher, um, just kind of made me think that this is, is a discipline that um, that I really want to learn about and focus on, and, and it's really been an important part of a lot of the different things that we do at Facebook. I mean, AI um, underscores newsfeed and ranking and showing people the best content, um, search and, and making sure that you can find people, um, suggesting the right friends to you uh, when you when you sign up to make sure that you can ramp up. Find um, right ads. Ads, right? <laughs> <laughs> ads, and then I mean, this is what you're running now. Yeah. Um, but you know, 